As more bits of the truth make it out to the public, we see the picture of a helpless Phoebe Prince, racked by relentless bullying, going to school administrators and asking for their protection, only to be turned away and sent back to class. I have a question to ask of the prosecutors in the Phoebe Prince case. When are indictments to be recommended for South Hadley's principal, assistant principals, and I would ask for the superintendent himself, who was apparently engaging in attempting to mislead the public about what was known about the torture of this poor innocent girl and when it was known. Look, I know it's hard for people in small towns in Western Mass to hold the feet of their higher-ups to the fire. People in places like South Hadley are honest, hard-working people who must somehow, once the dust clears, carry out their lives in these towns and in these schools. But if people are holding back and expressing their outrage at the blame falling squarely on the school and district administrators who are paid hundreds of thousands of dollars to protect their children from harm, then these townspeople will end up having to live with their school and community leaders walking around amongst them, emboldened by their safety from blame. I know I couldn't live with that. Could you?